So is that it? Are we just done with the island now? But I've, uh, I've still got so many questions that have gone unanswered, like... Why do we still have a fire extinguisher? Are we gonna get a magnum at some point? I mean, come on, it is a Resident Evil game. What's with all those toxic gases in the basement? What happened to our friend Mr. Juan Rodriguez? Where's Steve? Did... did Leon ever get our email? What really is going on with Alfred? Well, I bet all these and more will probably be answered in the next few minutes. Resident Evil. Alright, so let's get out of here. Hello everybody, and welcome to my blind let's play of Resident Evil Code Veronica, with Mio Xfu. Claire! And this is Steve. <laughs> Those people named survivors. We'd better get out of here too. Right. Let's go. Apparently somebody survived the uh the, the zombie apocalypse on this island. Either that, or the zombies have learned to fly planes. And we're all doomed. <laughs> anyway, last episode of Let's Blindly Play Resident Evil Code Veronica. We found out that Alfred and Alexia are actually the same person. Uh, Alfred started the self-destruct sequence upon our learning that. Because I guess he just doesn't want the secret to get out. Or he just has run out of ideas of how to kill us. Because let's face it, as Alfred or as Alexia, he is a terrible shot. Like, he barely even winged. Steve, and he was, what, five paces away? I could do better than that, and I've never handled a gun. An air soft, or er, not air soft, an air gun. That's about it. And those ones at carnivals that you have every so often. Anyway, it was pretty, it was pretty terrible. And this guy's in charge of a military island. Organi not organization, complex. There we go. So, let's get out of here. Oh no, zombies! I didn't know that! God, where are they coming from? I thought I took care of them all. Oh god, maybe the fish is now a zombie fish. Oh god, everything is, is lost. How's it going, Steve? That sounds like a good plan. Good thing there's no countdown timer, otherwise we'd probably be screwed. Yeah. Apparently. The control panel for the lift. Yeah, let's push the switch, leave Steve up there. <laughs> he wasn't on the lift at that point, so. Alright, so. Finally get to try this baby out. Let's, uh, hope this doesn't end up like the end of Resident Evil 2 with a giant mass just on the end. Ooh! What do we have there? I... I don't know. I can't get over to it. Can you, can you get up on top? Claire? No? Okay. Oh! There, there's a... No. We can't take off unless we raise the bridge! Leave that to me. You stay here and make preparations for takeoff. But, Claire, if you raise the bridge, it, you can't get back over here! Uh, uh. <laughs> Let's just see how long Steve just sits there playing with the controls, shall we? Oh god. He's like a kid in the candy shop. It's like this is the first time he's ever even been in a plane. Alright. So we got more ink ribbons. Um... I just saved. I'm not gonna use the ink ribbons. I don't think it's locked. Okay. I don't think it's that important that we use the ink ribbons right now. I'll use them once we get back on the plane. How about that? <laughs> I'm just, I'm just picturing Steve sitting there, pushing every button, flipping every switch, and just being like, "Ooh, what does this one do?" And like, it's, it's the old gag where something happens that you're not expecting at all, like. 
it pours you a cup of coffee or something. It's got nothing to do with flight at all. <laughs> so, we have the control lever, and I know where that goes. The one bad thing that I can think of... Oh, no, besides that, I thought I could run by him. I was wrong, I ran past that guy at least. Jeez, I'm starting to slip. Starting to, starting to get complacent. So the one bad thing I can think of is, um, besides the fact that when we raise the bridge, we're going to be on the other side. So, too bad for us. Guess we're going to have to do a flying leap on top or something crazy like that. Um, the way I'm assuming we get back around is that there's the, the door over here for uh, K402 or what whatever, what have you. We don't have a key for that. Aw oh, man, remember this little thing? Man, wasn't that a fun time? Got to play a crane game, just hang out, have some fun with a few couple of zombies. It was great times. Now we gotta jump on a runaway plane? Yes, yes, the control lever is missing. Oh wait, so that's gonna raise it up to our level. Yeah, raise the lever. Oh, okay, and then there's another door that we haven't even seen yet. So, uh, okay, that's cool. What have we, what do we have here? Man, I hope it's something good. Uh, Bridges oil pressure. O okay. Uh, ooh! Aw, oh, man, the fish tank! Aw, oh, man. We could totally take the fish with us. We could save him. I, 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 I. Ooh, they're gonna come to life. Yeah, take that airport key. Don't, don't do it. Stay dead. We good? Yeah, he's already dead, but that doesn't mean he's gonna stay dead. All right, so we got the airport key. I don't... No, really, I don't understand why it, why it opens up there. I mean, unless we're gonna go through there somehow. Like, maybe that's how we get back down to Steve. We end up having to jump in and, like, shatter the glass or something like that. So, uh... Steve down... Still down there? I can't tell. Did he already taxi out, maybe? And, uh... We gotta go meet him on the airport. Airport, the ocean, or maybe already took off, left us in the lurch. The bastard. Yep, yeah, the airport key. Yes, we will, because otherwise we're kind of screwed. <laughs> All right, so finally we get to go through here. Cool. And. Okay. Um, maybe I will. I will not. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We got a chest right here. I was going to say, maybe I will actually save my progress. It doesn't seem like a good thing that they put another typewriter right here. Yeah, I'm going to do it because I'm, I'm a, I'm a, pan, I'm a, I'm a pansy. I'm a coward. I don't care if I even get a D for my rank. I don't want to do the same thing three times in a row. Oh man, wait, wait, wait. Should we use him? I think this is as good a time as any to take out these MP100s, M100P pistols. Ooh. Are we not going to be able to go back? Ooh, 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 ooh. Let's drop off the bowgun. Alright. 
I saw those herbs. I think I believe them. So, yes, take all the green herbs. We're not coming back here, as far as I can tell. Unless I am so wrong, and this is going to screw me over far down the line. <laughs> I love how the self-destruct has been activated for about... 10 minutes now? <laughs> Ooh! Is that pistol ammo? Yeah! Okay. I'm down with that. Okay. But why... Um... Give us grenade ammo. So I'm gonna hold on to that grenade ammo. I don't like the looks of that. Wait. <laughs> okay, just controls the room's air conditioning. Uh, Claire, you're you're. Are you okay? You're halfway through the door. Okay. As long as you're okay. Oh. I guess we gotta... Move things? Oh. You gotta move things. Okay. Um. There we go. Okay. Like, we gotta move this one first, I thought. No. Okay. This is a problem. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I know, I know what we can do. Just push this under the door. There we go. And this one we just push out of the way. Or not. Guess we don't. Guess we're kind of... Uh, okay. Maybe it's not blocked anymore? No, it's still blocked. Okay. Where, where do I push from then? It's not letting me push this one. Come on, give, throw me a bone. All right, I'm gonna just go through every corner, one by one, checking for where I can push. Every corner, I meant every side. I know. There we go. All the way over. Then we can push it in. There we go. Tried that earlier. It didn't work. There we go. Now the elevator's gonna leave without us, right? Right. Five minutes until detonation. Oh, great. Now the timer decides to kick in. Okay. <laughs> Love that they still run through the cutscenes. So we don't have five minutes. We've got four minutes and now you fools to escape. This is what you get for trying to oppose me. Now feel my revenge. <laughs> At least she still got the laugh. What? What? <laughs> Just... <laughs> D okay? Just gonna throw that out there at the last moment? Okay. Wow. It's like, are we gonna, ever gonna see those other guys either? You know, the, uh, the, what are they, what are they called, um... The Albions or whatever? Albinoids? Or are they just gone forever? Oh, jeez! <laughs> I guess those explosive barrels finally di decide to explode. Oh no, it looks like it's a bit worse than that. Hello. Shall we dance? I must warn you. I have been trained in the art of... Oh. Using a grenade launcher. Yeah. 
Get out of my way. Oh, okay, don't get out of my way. Uh, take some more. Yeah. You another Mr. X then? See ya. Uh, okay. Oh, <laughs> I wanted to check if I could go in there. That's all. Uh, is that it? Was he just there to kind of take up time? Or are we gonna run into another? Ooh, that would be cool. Maybe she's just got like a ton of them, and they're just gonna come out of like the woodwork now. Oh, that would that would actually be a like cool escape sequence. If uh, whether you live or die is is based. Ooh. Wait a minute. Okay, it's still there. Whew. I'm like, wait a minute. <laughs> and at least the time is not running during this cutscene. This is a long cutscene, so. That's good at least. But maybe that would be cool if your, uh. Whether you live or die was based on your skill at taking out those guys. At least it would be cool for an enemy that we actually knew how to fight. <laughs> so, I mean, this is the first time we met this guy, so... Or is he gonna help? Like... One's actually in the back! <laughs> Something crazy... Oh, come on, no, come on. I'm being stupid and wasting time now. No, yes, cry climb the ladder. Don't be an idiot. Me. <laughs> Alright. Oh, man, now I'm expecting more <laughs> to just show up. And, and I'd be, I would be so happy if they did. Come on. No, I guess... Unless they show up, like, right in here. Come on. Alright, wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. We are finally using these pistols. Come on. Yeah. Sorry, Mr. Fish, but we couldn't save you. We don't have the time! We don't have a minute and 50 seconds to save you! It's too long, it's too long. We'd have to go up, back up, and get a fishbowl, and that would take at least two minutes! So yeah, we're done. With uh, the island, I guess. Let's jet, shall we? Took you so long! I was starting to get worried. No time to explain. Let's go. Right. We're out of here. Time to say goodbye to this death trap.